Am I? I feel like I'm very. Hi. Oh, what's up, my Hi, everyone. Welcome back to a brand new video. I know I have not uploaded in a very long time. I do apologise, but you know what? Life gets in the way. So I apologise. But I am back. I've got some time off work for Christmas. And I'm going to be filming, hopefully bulk up a lot of content as well so that you have regular uploads in January. I've got a lot of exciting ideas, but I'm jumping ahead of myself. Today I'm going to be filming a what I got for my 25th birthday video. That makes me feel really old. <laughs> um, I'm a quarter away to a century. A century? I'm a quarter century years old. That's right, right? Quarter century? All I know is I'm 25 and that's halfway to 50, which is quite scary. I got some lovely, lovely presents and I always love watching videos like this of other people because I'm nosy and I just am curious. And it also gives you some good gift ideas as well. Because my birthday is in December, I feel like this might help some people out looking for present ideas for their girlfriends, mothers, friends, sisters, aunties, nieces, whatever. My main present I cannot show you because it isn't anything physical. George, my boyfriend, paid for me and him to stay at a hotel in London for the weekend. We just got back. No, we didn't. That's a lie. It's Tuesday. We got back on Sunday. I put some pictures up on the screen of what the hotel looked like. It was called the West... The Westbourne Hyde Park? I don't know. I can't remember. But I will post pictures. It was really, really nice. We had a lovely, lovely room. Um, we had like a microwave and like a little stove in our room as well. Like it was very bougie. I felt like a, a celebrity, you know. So... Yeah, and it was so close to Hyde Park, which is, well, that's what's well, in the name, isn't it? It's called Hyde Park Hotel. It was literally like a five minute, 10 minute walk to Hyde Park. It wasn't far at all. So yeah, really nice hotel. And George paid for that as my main birthday present. Um, we'll carry on with George's stuff. Malfi's gin. Oh my God, I am, can you not? Oh, I was sniffing on my presents and I don't want him to take anything out. Um, yeah, so it's Malfi gin. This flavor is pink grapefruit and oh my God, it is the nicest gin I have ever had. This is what it looks like. It's quite a pricey gin, I'm not gonna lie. I think it's like 25, 30 pounds, but obviously this isn't something you take to like a pre-drink or a party. It's something that is very strong. It's 41%, but it just smells. Oh, it smells so nice. That smells like you can just drink it like juice, but you definitely can't. Pink Malphite Gin, highly recommend this with lemonade, raspberry lemonade in particular. And he also, I already see my trainers. And now I'm going to definitely have to get some like protection spray on them because they are white. Like, <gasps> they're so pretty. Oh my goodness gracious me. And they've got like the little, and then, yes. I'm a fan, but as you can see, they are very, very white. So I don't want to ruin them. Uh, so I definitely have to get some protection spray for these. But yeah, those are my presents from George. So I got my trainers, my gin, and the hotel room in London. I will stick on the theme for alcohol for a second. So Tara, my younger sister, got me three little, little, what did I say little? Three little pink gin sets. So I've got Beef Eater one, which is pink strawberry. Oh my goodness gracious me. A Green All's Wild Berry Gin. And then I got obviously the classic pink Gordon's Gin, which, you know, basic girl like me loves this. So I got three little minis. Um, and then she got me this, dis well, I collect like limit, well, I used to collect limited edition De Serrano bottles, like the alcohol, which is like basically, tastes like amaretto, if you know what amaretto is. I don't actually know what De Serrano is. It tastes a bit like marzipan, if you like marzipan, but she got me this one and I was like, oh, a white bottle, I've never seen that before. But it's not just like, De Serrano that you get, it's a velvet liqueur and it's a smooth cream with the unmistakable taste of De Serrano. So it's like a, I can't obviously show you because it's like covered. Oh, it smells so good. It's a creamy drink. So it's more like, it looks like milk inside, which I quite like a cream based drink for like alcoholic drink. Like I love a pina colada. So I'm very excited to try some of this in a cocktail. I've already had some in my hot chocolate and it's just oh, so good. Again, from Tara. She got me a Smirnoff vodka, but it's the, I don't know if it's limited edition. It's mango and passion fruit. Like, look at that. It smells like heaven. Oh my God, it, my mouth just watered instantly. It smells like, do you know the Solera ice pops you get, which is like cream on the inside and then like an orange passion fruit, orangey casing. That's really bad. 
description of what Solera is. But Solera is like my favorite ice cream, ice pop, ice cream, I don't know what it is. And it smells like that. It tastes obviously like vodka. This I think would be really nice with um, Fanta Fruit Twist, I think, or maybe like a Rubicon Mango, or oh, anything like Caribbean flavors, like pineapple, coconut, passion fruit, would be really nice with this. And I love this. So I've got like a little bar, there's so all of my drinks have gone onto my bar so far. I'll do what George's mum got me. She got me a few little bits. Some of them are not here. Oh, they're upstairs. Okay, well, I'm gonna show you the ones that are here and then I'll talk about the ones upstairs because I can't bother to really to go get them because it's so far away and I'm so lazy. First one, she got me this little mug and it's really cute. It's got a little dog and a little girl with an umbrella and a shopping bag and I am obsessed with Paris. So it says, I often daydream that my life is just as it is now, dot, dot, dot. Only I have well-behaved hair, which I probably need, and I live in Paris, which I think is very fitting for me. <laughs> so cute little mug, can never have too many mugs in your house. Honestly, hot chocolate, coffee, tea, sorted. Um, she also got me this. Oh my God. Oh, it's gonna be really weird because it's mirrored. Wow, I'm talking. This is really, really weird. Um, yeah, so she got me this. I don't know how to show you where it's like not gonna reflect everything. Maybe there, okay. It's a mirrored, as you can tell. It's like, a, I don't know if it's like a jewelry box thing or you can put like little trinkets in here, but it's just like a little little box that's mirrored. This is gonna really trip me out, but yeah. Mirrored little box, which is really, really nice. Then, what did she, what did she get me that's in? Oh, it's, it's like a nice, it's like a tray that's got like a mirror at the bottom and then it's got like flowers on the around the outside. So like you put it on your, like your coffee table and stuff and put things on it, which is really, really pretty. Oh, she got me this, which I absolutely love. It's Prosecco Pong. Now I do love playing beer pong at a party or like a little gathering, don't get me wrong, but Prosecco Pong, up my street. And it comes with so many little pink ping pong balls on the inside, which is really fun. So one of my best friends, Beth, was an actually able to come to Winter Wonderland with us, which was really upsetting, but she had a very, very, very valid reason. Um, but like I said, her boyfriend Dom came because we all like know each other. But she did send me some presents, which is really sweet of her. So first of all, a lovely little Barry M lip gloss, which I literally just put on my lips before this video. This is very like glossy up a little bit on as you can see. But yeah, I just think it's a really nice, really nice lipstick shade, lip gloss shade. She got me this cute, oh, there's like, I left it upstairs again. I'm just very unorganized. So she got me this bag, which I love, but it also has like a tiny little mini bag, like this big attached, which is upstairs. Um, it's just so annoying. Did I not put it in here? Oh, it's here. It's here. Look at that. <laughs> Look at this little bag. So you attach that on to, yeah. So it has like, it's like a bag with a bag with a bag and like a nice long strap. So you can have it as a strap or you can have it as a little clutch, which I think is nice, you know, cause you can take this off and have it as a little, little, put it inside if you want, like a little, what would you have this, like money, coins, like a little purse inside your bag, or like that, it's very versatile, and I like it, and black goes with everything as well. So I love it, so thank you. And also, probably my favorite thing that she got me, I'm very into like crystals and spirituality, if you guys didn't know, I've done quite a lot of videos on them in the past, and I've always wanted to go and see the Psychic Sisters in Selfridges, I really hate they're in Selfridges. Imagine if I've said that and they, they're completely not there. Hold on, give me a second. Yeah, they're in Selfridges. Okay, I just completely thought I made that then. I didn't realise they have crystal sets that you can buy. So she got me the crystal set, which is for power. And it's, I'll show you them inside, but it's got, um, it's got Jasper Heart, Tiger's Eye Quartz, Carnelian, Rose Quartz, Citrine and Amethyst. Um, and it, you have to say as the affirmation, I am strong, focused and in control. And it has directions as well. So select three crystals in the morning, focus on the affirmation and chant six times in your mind. Keep your crystals close to you throughout the day. So I love this. Um, I will show you them inside. Cube, you can't really see them, but they all fit in this little bag. Um, um, but yeah, some nice little crystals. So yeah, that is from Beth, and thank you so much. I absolutely love this, and it goes in my little bag like this with my lip gloss, which I wore a lot at the weekend when I went to London. My mum, my mum got me a lot of stuff as well. So, oh, she got me a leather jacket again, which is not in here. She got me a black leather jacket, which I am obsessed with. I love the style of a leather jacket, and I got one in like a gray, a light pink and a dusty pink. And I was like, I just want a black one because black goes with everything. So she got me a black leather jacket, which is, in my um, utility room. Got me these shorts, which I asked for and love. There are some nice 
shorts like for like nights out and stuff she got me loads and loads and loads of hair products which i'm not going to show you all of them but <laughs> there was like a big box of hair products which i'm really grateful for so some of them are they all in it i've used some already i've got i've got two here so she got me a special shampoo and conditioner which i've got upstairs because i used it yesterday in the shower she got me Cantu's grow strong strengthening treatment which is this little tub here and then she got me the sheer moisture strengthen and restore treatment mask which i used to use all the time and then there is a curling cream upstairs which i used on my hair literally just a minute ago but yeah like for my type of hair products like like the general products you get like shampoo conditioner leave-in treatments and stuff are always so expensive i never have enough money to buy them in bulk <laughs> so my, I, asked my, I said to my mum i was like i need these products for my hair because it's really difficult just to go to the shop and buy them i used to have to buy them on amazon because a lot of the shops by me don't do hair products for my kind of hair Superdrug have just started doing them which is really good but now i've got loads so this should stop me up for a while she got me charlotte tilbury's pillow talk mascara which i have been asking for for a very long time i've actually got it on today you can't really see because i've got um eyeliner on which is stupid of me it's amazing i've literally put it on because it comes with like a little tester as well so i'm gonna use my tester one first and when that runs out then use the big one i actually haven't even opened the Let's see what it looks like oh i love the packaging so much i don't know what the brush is like oh look at it the guys never smell of anything do they really it's got like a it's not a bristle brush it's like a plastic brush which i quite like oh it just looks so i think that just looks so classy so yeah pillows talk mascara which i love so yeah very happy with this and then i have plans for the top of my stairs because when you open my front door which is literally just there my stairs are like right in front of you and you can see up my stairs and there's nothing there and i really want a console table at the top of my stairs and i asked for a reed diffuser to go on the console table that i don't have yet but this is called fifth i already opened it as you can see this is called fifth avenue and it's from dunno mill and it's sandalwood and musk and it's quite a big i can't get into it it's quite a big reed diffuser look at that look how nice that looks i love a reed diffuser and I really like this one. It's 150 mil. Sandalwood and Musk is one of my favourite scents ever. And I think this one's going to look so nice on like a nice black tray at the top of my stairs. Everything I opened for my birthday I've used because I'm filming this quite a couple of days after my birthday and I've used them already. She got me this little rose quartz roller for your face. I just, I just like a little face massage. I'm going to take off all my makeup now. Yeah, it's rubbing off on here. I don't want to get my makeup on it. But yeah, and they've got a little tiny one for like under your eyes and stuff. And it's very relaxing to do after you put your like your face oils and creams and moisturizers on at night i like to do it before bed so yeah i got that and then i was really shocked when i saw this little bag behind all the presents um and i knew what it was straight away because i've only ever asked me for one thing from chanel uh and then it got she got a gift wrapped for me which is just so cute so it come in like this little box here and then when you open it up it was like that look at that look how fancy that looks um and it is my favorite well one of my favorite perfumes of all time which is oh my god sorry i'm trying to i didn't want to ruin the packaging so i was really careful with it it is the coco chanel mademoiselle perfume and i have one upstairs already from a few years ago that i use very sparingly because it's very expensive oh but just look at the bottle i just don't think you can go wrong with a chanel bottle because i mean just look how look at that so yeah absolutely obsessed with this perfume thank you so much mum because it's not it's not cheap at all but i just love the box i just love i love this this is also it either might go on my console table or it might go in my wardrobe room where i get ready like my makeup room that i used to do my videos and if you remember i feel like i'm forgetting something and i'm gonna feel really bad at the end when i finish this and i'm gonna be like oh crap yeah oh Callum and Kira, the people who come to an online with me, they got me a bath tray because I've wanted one for ages because I go a bit over the top with my baths. I have like candles and music and chocolates and wine and a book and my phone and bubbles and room spray. I go like a bit, a bit extra for my baths and everything's just always on the floor. Like my phone and the chocolates and the drink I always have to bring up, I just put on the floor and it's really hard to like have to always go over, pick it up because I get all cold. So they got me a bath tray and I used it last night when I had a bath. It's great. 
I had a YouTube video going on in the corner, that, like on the stand that I could watch. I had a book, I had a mince pie, I had my hot chocolate with my Disserano in. It was great, I had a great time. See, I knew I was forgetting something. My granddad got me a £30 postcard voucher, which I think I filmed in my video of my actual birthday because I did vlog that. So he got me a postcard voucher, which you can spend in so many places, like food shops, actual shops, online stores, loads of places. I think it's like over a hundred places you can spend it on. And then George's nan also got me a postcard voucher for 20 pounds and I've already used it for a dress for my birthday. <laughs> that was it for today's video, guys. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed and I hope you got some inspiration for other people for gifts and stuff. But yeah, don't forget to like, comment, subscribe and give me some ideas down below of any like December slash January content that you would like to see because I am back, she says for the 10th millionth time on this channel. But don't forget to like, comment, subscribe and I will see you guys soon for a brand new video.